Yep, that's me. Hello, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name's Liz. I started a new series that I didn't realize I was going to start called Turning Celebrities Tweets Into Songs. Today, we are turning my favorite human in the literal entire world tweets into a song. If you haven't been following me, hi, my name's Liz and I fucking love Taylor Swift. <laughs> what Taylor's tweets is, she used to tweet a lot more. She doesn't tweet as much now. She's starting to. But like her first tweets were very, 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 very funny. The thing about her tweets is that they're not like tweets like Noah Centineo where they're easy to put in a song and you wouldn't know that they're tweets. So this song I wouldn't say is gonna be like good, it's gonna be more funny. She tweeted things like, watching Cats in the Womb on Discovery Channel while hundreds of people I don't know leave me drunken voicemails, it's a Friday night. Conversations with myself while shopping, put the candle down, you already have too many candles, put it down, but it smells so pretty. The moment you buy scissors and then you try to open them but you can't because you don't have scissors. Crazy to think about how many countries I've lost hair ties in. I kinda want that to be the first lyric. So yeah, those are the kinds of tweets that we're working with. I don't know how this is gonna go, if we're being quite honest. I don't know what direction this is gonna go, so I'm kind of scared. Taylor, if you're watching this, which like, I said this at the beginning of the Noah video too, and I was like, if you're watching this, you probably are, and then you watched it. I highly doubt Taylor Swift is gonna watch this, but if for some reason you are, I love you with everything in me. You are my favorite person in the entire world and I would literally take a bullet for you. So if you ever need a human sacrifice, hey, let's go. I feel like I'm dressed like a school teacher, so. Hey kids, spelling is fun. This is what I have so far. It's two lines, but it's something. Also, I'll put a timestamp on the screen to where you can just skip to the song if you don't want to watch the process, but from my first video, a lot of you guys liked seeing the process of how I did it, so I'm just gonna keep doing it until you tell me otherwise. <laughs> it's crazy to think how many countries I've lost hair ties in. I'm stuck in my own concert traffic, which is conflicting. That's all I have. So I'm thinking, it's crazy to think how many countries I've lost hair ties in. I'm stuck in my own concert traffic and it's conflicting. I'm watching Cats in the Womb on Discovery Channel while hundreds of people, I don't know, leave me drunken voicemails. And maybe I could go into like a pre-chorus of some sort. I'm just gonna write it down and then we're gonna move on and then I'll come back to it because that's what I usually do. I'm watching Cats in the Womb on Discovery Channel. Hundreds of people I don't know Why do I always sing it wrong out loud but when I sing it in my head I sing it right? Leave me drunk in voicemails I have to use this tweet as my 25th birthday present from the media I'd like for you to stop accusing all my friends of dating me Hashtag thirsty Oh I'm still recording I zoned out Okay so I'm thinking as my 25th birthday present from the media I'd really love it for you Stop accusing all my friends that they in me Hashtag thirsty Something like that. I'm gonna have to add words in there a little bit to make it fit But for the most part, it'll be her tweet Hello Time has passed. I've added some more I'm thinking the course is gonna be Jalapenos or nature's pepper spray. Put that candle down. You have too many. A VS angel jumped my battery and I screamed run forest run at Brad Paisley. I open my purse and see she just fell out. I open my purse and see she just fell out. Experience of it first sight. Love it first sight with this couch. Jalapenos or nature's pepper spray. Put that candle down. You have too many. A VS Angel jumped my battery. I screamed run for us, run it, Brad Paisley. I opened my purse and seashells so loud, experience love at first sight with this couch. I'm no longer scared of the sound. I'll come, I'll be back when I have something. Basically, I tried to sit down to film me singing the Taylor song I wrote. And I can't decide if I sound like ass or not. Also, I want to fit the scissors tweet. But I don't know how to fit the scissors tweet in it. Also, I really want to add fuck sewing machines. But I also feel like I should keep it somewhat child friendly. Okay, 
here's where we're at i slammed my hand in my guitar case my strumming hand and it hurts like motherfucker i'm just gonna say it second i'm singing through the song and i can't sing it as fast as i thought i could and if i slow it down it just doesn't sound right so now i think i have to write a new melody did i think how many countries i've lost here tyson i'm stuck in my own concert traffic and disconflicting that was terrible. Um, I have moved to the piano. I'm freaking annoyed. You think how many countries I've lost to Tyson? I'm stuck in my own concert traffic and disconflicting. Now I need more lyrics. Fuck! I can't believe I've just done this. And answer my business emails with all the whatever I want. to the chorus but I was so close to being done and I messed up this is my song using only two of swift tweets that I've decided to call fuck stolen machines I wasn't gonna swear but that old myspace post just had to be used it's crazy to think how many countries I've lost hair ties in Stuck in my own concert traffic, which is conflicting. I'm watching cats in the womb on Discovery Channel, while hundreds of people I don't know leave me drunk in voicemails. As my 25th birthday present from the media, I really, really love it for you to finally stop accusing all my friends of dating me. Hashtag thirsty. using only Taylor Swift tweets. Didn't think I was gonna have to rewrite the whole thing, but I'm happy with how it turned out. I don't know what to say. I also really want to write a song using like things that she said, like in interviews, like like meaningful, deep, serious quotes. So if that's something you guys would want to see, let me know and I can write a song with that. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you stream by Lover. August 23rd. I love you guys with my whole heart and I will see you in my next video. Bye.